guys, here's a page that I should have talked to you about a long time ago, but I didn't because I thought they were much bigger than they actually are and that everyone knew about them. But uh, today, while browsing it, I realized they only have like 16,000 likes, which by Facebook standards is pretty small. So um, I'm gonna read you... Uh, a, a few of their posts. It's a page called Babies Names and it's a page dedicated to give you ideas for babies names if you like are pregnant and don't know how to name your child. This page has some great suggestions and I absolutely love every single one of them and I want to uh, show you just a few examples of the brilliance of this page. So um, Let's uh, look at it right now. Here's the latest post. Corn cob ossuary. It's very classy. I like it. It's very, it's very uh, dignified. Very nice. Uh, what this one? Citronella linalool. Oh, this one is really, really like swag. If you want your kid, your kid to have swag, name him or her. It's probably a girl name. Citronella linalool. That's, yeah. Press start! Oh, gamers, rise up! Gangweed! Uh, uh, fuck. Ugh. Gamers, as you know, are the, the most oppressed uh, minority in today's society. And uh, if you want to give your uh, child a gamer name, they, it will, you know, the oppression will, will make them strong, you know, and they, they will uh, become a better person as a result. And also, uh, they will be the best at Call of Duty 52 when they're uh, gonna be adults. So, uh, Blood Muppet is the next one. I mean, technically, I'm, we're, I'm going backwards in time, so it's the previous one. But uh, Blood Muppet, that's pretty, that's, you know, that's metal, but, uh, but cute, you know. In a cute way, like uh, like Baby Metal from Japan, Great Bond, uh, or Parody Party Cannon, you know, from uh, I think they're from the U.S. Blood Muppet is a pretty balanced name, you know, and uh, it's uh, it's good as well uh, for a boy as well as for a girl, in my opinion. Uh, hydroponic fish, you know that if you want your kid to be like a marine biologist, some kind of scientist. If you want him to be some kind of George Costanza power type, George Costanza uh, hashtag Sheldon Cooper. I don't know why I say hashtag. I meant to say fusion, but you know you get it. Hydroponic fish. That's uh, the finest hydroponic in all of Shire. Uh, that's a uh, that's an obscure reference for uh, my uh, webcomic fans who uh, know Elf Tour, the best webcomic of all time. Floopsy crazy. I'm not a fan of this one. It's a little too, you know, it's a little too cuckoo. It's a little too Polly unsaturated cat. Now that's also a very classy name. Love this one. Very thoughtful uh, and powerful at the same time. Mm -mm, I was gonna say next, but previous. Uh, young puppy. That, that's probably. Um, that's probably uh, a mistake, because that's not a child's name, that's a SoundCloud rapper's name. And as we all know, SoundCloud rappers are not human, so you cannot uh, give a, a SoundCloud rapper name to your baby, because babies are people and SoundCloud rappers aren't. Uh, next, Dr. Karate. Yeah, it's uh, it's very 80s, you know, it's uh, at the moment the full wave of the 80s revival and this one sounds like uh, like an 80s movies action hero, so uh, yeah, if you're a nostalgic kind of person, you know, and if you want to address your child in uh, NES themed uh, on his eyes, uh, it's, uh, you know, it's pretty good. Um, this one is, uh, it's uh, probably Swedish, because there's a lot of letters, or, or German. Injured Grove Warden. That sounds like one of the, I don't know if you're on Tumblr, but that sounds like the, the name from one of these far-right Tumblr uh, that keep uh, posting weird shit. That sounds exactly like one of these weird, uh, you know, crypto-fascist uh, Tumblr users. And, 
Next, Morbid Orb. That's, uh, I'm wearing a Dark Souls shirt with the great Grey Wolf Sif. And uh, Morbid Orb resonates uh, with me. I, I like it. I like it. Uh, scribbled down. Yeah, that's uh, this one is ballsy. This one is daring. This one is pretty. Uh, you know, it's a bold choice. It's that's what the word I was looking for. Bold. It's bold, like seven. You know, Fortnite gems. <laughs> I forgot about this one. <laughs> oh damn. Is there even need to comment on this one? No, the, it's, the name says it all. Next, that's probably also uh, Swedish or, uh, you know, Suomi maybe. Shabby Coaster. Pretty classic, pretty, you know, this one is not very daring, but uh, it's, uh, you know, it's a kind of name that uh, will ensure that your, your kid has a normal childhood because it's uh, it's the kind of name that is pretty banal, and uh, that's also a good choice, like naming your kid John. Uh, and uh, Shabby Coaster also has this uh, vibe, which uh, which is good, you know? Crying Ghostly! <laughs> Those names are so good. They know, I don't really want kids, but when I see this, I'm rethinking my life choices because uh, so many good names, you know, Bishop Goose. Yeah, also a, a not very daring one, pretty classic, pretty. Uh, if you want your kid to, uh, you know, uh, melt in the crowd, melt in the crowd. Is that really how you say it? To be unnoticeable, but uh, you know that's good. You know, it's uh, like naming your kid John or Mike. <sighs> Tomato ketchup. Absolute classic if you're an old-school person, you know, the kind of person to have a mahogany desk and uh, smoke a pipe, you know, the kind of old-school person to wear a, a tweed jacket, you know? Tomato ketchup is, is that kind of name. It's, uh, it's classic, really solid. It's a really, it's woody. It's a woody kind of name. It's earthy. It feels good in the mouth. Tomato ketchup for the classic gentleman. And um, yeah, I'm gonna read a, uh, um, a few more. Hyaluronic acid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A bit, a bit ghetto for my liking, but you know, the Constitution is fake. <laughs> Subscribe to Infowars by Super Mario Vitality. The Constitution is fake. You know, for um, if, if ever, and that is a scenario out of my wildest dreams, but if ever, Nicolas Cage and Alex Jones have a child together that they should call him or her, the Constitution is fake! That's... Burp Box! No, that's a... Uh... Whoa, that's a daring, that's a bold choice. That's uh, that's a kid that's gonna, you know, go fast on skateboards and do some graffiti, uh, you know, some kind of, uh, some kind of punk. That's pretty styrofoam bones. Wow, that's, uh, he's gonna be, uh, he's gonna be duting all his life and uh, drinking lots of milk, you know, and uh, he's gonna be the, the prom queen at, um, Fucking uh, Halloween, you know? Ashamed gamer. <laughs> flip Trickster, the tricky flipper who almost always flips. Uh, that's actually the name of uh, Tony Hawk's kid. So, uh, yeah, if you can't handle me at <laughs> The red flag name, redder than red. <laughs> Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, last one, last one, yeah, last one. 
uh, epic interwebs. That's perfect to finish uh, this video. This page has been uh, around for years and years, so uh, they they post about once a day. So you have literally thousands of babies' names to choose from uh, if you if you plan to have a child. So, so much great inspiration. So uh, many awesome names. I really wanted to, to talk about this page and when I saw how s small their, their like count was, I, uh, you know, that's weird. They should be more famous, they should have more uh, followers, they really deserve it. It's an, really, really one of the, the best pages around in my opinion. And you guys always ask me, what are my favorite uh, pages on Facebook? This is one of them. And uh, with that, I'm gonna say... Thank you all for watching, thanks a fucking bunch to my patrons on Patreon who help make this show possible. You, your subscription are all, they all matter and they're all greatly appreciated and thanks, really. And uh, to all of you, I'm saying, uh, don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed yet, and see y'all really soon. Peace!